There are about 69,000 students in Osceola County who will soon be adjusting to online learning. Now the district held a press conference to talk about how this is going to work and what resources they're providing to families. Our primary concern is, of course, the health and safety of our students. New rules and regulations to help stop the spread of the coronavirus have schools going virtual. Officials with the Osceola County School District say transitioning to online learning isn't going to be easy, but it is the safest option. There will be a learning curve for our students and our educators to get used to these changes. Some things will not be taught as effectively compared to be physically in the schools. Electives may be put on hold and many will miss friends and colleagues. Digital learning begins Monday, March 30th. Students will be able to view and complete their assignments on the class link portal on the district's website. Students who need a laptop or Wi-Fi hotspot can request one by calling their school. When it comes to laptop distribution, high schoolers take priority. For our students without access to a digital device, we will be providing paper packets to keep learning happening at the elementary and middle school offices. I recommend that parents contact the school in advance. You can pick those packets up starting Monday afternoon, March the 30th. District officials say students will continue to earn grades and seniors must still meet the requirements for graduation. Graduations have not been canceled in Osceola County at this time. Now, the county will still be providing free breakfast and lunch to students at locations across the county, but students must accompany their parents when picking those meals up. For the exact locations and times, visit our website, WESH.com. In Osceola County, Megan Mulatto, WESH 2 News.